can feel your heart racing Cause everybody knows Yeah, everybody knows And I can feel the body shaking every, every single touch That's just how it goes That's just how it goes oh, oh, oh. Sassy T from the 803. How are you guys doing? Doing good. Just got off of work. Had a pretty busy day, but not too, too busy. Okay. Um, I thought I would do a quick video before I get home because, you know, I had some things that I might want to run by you guys. Some things that I've been deep thinking about, especially about Mr. Marceau. Um, man, I think I got Marceau figured out. Okay. Now, um, <laughs> he's he, he's in a, a state of panic right now. Okay, let's just be sure, be clear. Don't let this man fool y'all and don't think um, that he's not panicking. And I'm gonna tell you why it's hard to read Marceau because of the actions he's done. And yes, he is hiding a whole lot of stuff. Um, before we get started, remember all things on this channel is alleged in my opinion. It is for learning. It is for teaching. It is for entertainment purposes. Okay? Entertainment purposes only. Today, we're going to learn some behaviors, honey. We're going to learn some secrets. We're going to expose the mentality of a cheater, a con man, a scanner, or a scammer. Uh, we're going to expose a lot, um, and uh, I'm not going to do it all on my video, but I am going to do it on my live. We're going to talk about it on my live, which will be at 6.15 if you guys are able to join me, okay? Uh, Mr. Martell Hope, we're going to talk about Martell first. Let me tell y'all where Martell get this three-year Thing that him and Mel is going to be back together. And Melody, I want you, I, I hope that you hear me. Um, and I hope that you understand what I'm saying. Um, you know, but uh, be careful with Martell. I know that you have your beautiful babies with him. I know that you want him to do the, be the best that he can be, but something is sitting in my spirit, and it's saying be careful, because I believe Martell is dipping and dabbing in um, psychic stuff, okay? There is something that popped up on my feed, and I was just having to read it, and it was about you know, Martell and his criminalistic behavior and, you know, stuff that we already talked about, but there was also something on there that, you know, this guy, this lady had said, um, I was like, what is this? And, you know, I don't deal in that kind of stuff, okay? But I do believe in prim um, premonition. I do believe that God warns you. I do believe in uh, discernment. And I, it's just something about Martell even if he wasn't on this show, gives me an eerie vibe because Martell who is a criminal. His entire family are criminals. They've done, him and his brother have terrorized, you know, Alabama, okay? Um, Huntsville, it's true. I mean, just ask anybody that lived there when they were younger. They were terrorists in their own neighborhood. Ask their mama. She know, that's why she drank all the time, okay? Um, but... Let, let me tell you this. Let me tell you this. Martell, y'all know at the end of the three years, he said he, he would be married again and him and Mel would be back together. When I read this, like a permit premonition thing or whatever, and it said the same thing Martell Hope was saying. And something popped in me and I was like, what? Wait, whoa, whoa. Is this joker um, going to psychics and 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 readings? 
because you know him and coleslaw they would do that because they don't have a moral compass they don't believe in nothing but themselves and their looks and they that's not too appeasing let me tell you something about martel ho martel ho is he's drowning and he's uh very desperate right now he is going to try to play male and male i hope you listen and don't fall for this but I know that, you know, sometimes you still have love for a person because you want them to do right. And let's be clear. Uh, I know you say you don't love him no more, but I know you always want him to do the best and be the best that he can be. But this man, he is going to try to use you to get in business because he is sinking. He has nothing. He is every bit of his money that he's invested he has lost and the only reason why he sticks around Ariane is because of this and I hate to say this and from my observation of the show I could be wrong but Melody is a go-getter she lives she breathes she thinks of business and money okay she is a go-getter she is going to make her money make her mark make her legacy she's going to continue to do it whether she every breath everything she can do and in my opinion even though i know martel was a uh a narcissist i think when you have that drive and the other partner don't have that drive it can cause division in your marriage it really can. And I don't care. Y'all can get mad at me or whatever you want to say. But a overdriven person and an underdriven person, it causes conflict. Because the underdriven person feels less than. And the overdriven person is like, you shouldn't feel less than. I'm doing it for us. Okay? But the uh, like Martel, he, he felt like, you know, uh, you ain't doing it for me. You know, you're doing it for yourself. This is what you always wanted. But you always want it. You always want to be famous. So I went along with you. Now it's just getting out of hand. This is his words. You know, you, you just driving, driving. You don't forget about me. You don't pay attention to me. But y'all work together. What you mean? She didn't pay attention to you. See, this is the lies you tell yourself to make it easier to, for you to sleep at night, Martel. But I feel like Martel is staying out of Ariane's pictures. Because he's trying to wean his way back into Mel by trying to get some work, trying to get business through Mel. I've said this before. Y'all, I've said this before. Go back and look at my videos. I've said it. I've said it time and time again. I I, I, I know Martel Ho. I know a Ho. Okay? And my ex is I, I, it's just like living it, but with on TV. Like, and Martel, let me tell you something. Martel would do anything at this point to make to get his money. Now, at this point in him and Ariane's um, relationship, there's a lot of resentment. That's why he would never marry her. He has invested money into her fake clothing line, and it is unsuccessful. It is not successful. Taking care of Ariane is a burden to Martel Hope. Okay? It is becoming a burden. The reason why he holds on to you, Ariane, with your dumb self, is because he can't afford child support. He can't afford health insurance. He can't afford none of that. So to to not for you not to um, take him out for that he's going to uh, of course stay around you and also the reason why in their marriage in uh, Martel and Melody's marriage Melody is constantly working even when she gets home sometimes it's hard to turn off I get it I'm like that too but <clears throat> Martel feels like he's constantly working when he was at home with Melody with Ariane she's simple she doesn't require much money he can relax around her because she doesn't require a lot out of him y'all understand what i'm putting down she doesn't have this big expectation she just loves him because she loves him he takes care of her but he can't take care of her anymore but 
when she came around, that's when he felt at ease and that he was uh, he could relax. With Melody, he was always tense and money is always business. Get up, be free business. Go to, you know, do this business, do that business. Even on vacation, business, 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 okay? But that's what it costs when you want. When you want success, that's the price you got to pay. And just because you're not driven, Martel Hope, you know, you should never punish somebody else because... They have a driven spirit, okay? Let's just be clear. People with successful spirits, they don't know how to stop. But people that settle, do. Okay, they give up. And Martel, you know, he's always wanted things the easiest way. He's always wanted things this way. Handed to him. That's why he was out here stealing. That's why he was out here robbing. Yeah, yeah, no, yeah, was robbing banks and all this stuff. Yeah, so that's why you were out here doing all that stuff because you knew that um you wanted easy money because y'all didn't have nothing. Okay, I ain't had nothing. You ain't gonna have me out here stealing, giving up my freedom, freedom, freedom. But that's how Martel and his brother was. So, yeah, um, when it comes to driven people, Martel, he was not a driven person, but he wanted Mel to be driven because if she wins, he wins. And then once she got the accolades, once, you know, he started to disrespect her because he felt less than because he really realized that people would look at her and say she was the one. And he wanted, he wanted the recognition. And all along, she gave it to him. She cleaned you up. She cut that cuddle sack of a bald head off. She gave you veneers. You went to the gym, you start losing weight. You know, you start dressing nice. That woman cleaned you up from the shit that you was because you're still shit and ain't going to be shit and never was shit. Oh, because you always have and will have a criminal mind, okay? So, with that being said, he is going to try to get back with Mel on a business venture because he feels like he's at his low. And if he can just give Mel what she wants, which, you know, you know, uh, he's going to bend to that. He's getting ready to do the ultimate manipulation tactic. He is going to be everything that Mel wanted him to be outside of this marriage he's going to change oh he's gonna have y'all food he's gonna have me i think he can fool mel too but i'm letting her know and i'm warning her don't let it don't let him because all he wants is to get money to take care of her Ariane, and that baby that's it for a little while anyway um the reason why you know he's quiet they're plotting they're plotting He's plotting. He, 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 has, he has no choice but to be around Ariane. He can't afford to pay for her, you know, uh, her business. Why y'all think she's not out here uh, posting any more of her clothes? He can't invest in her anymore. He doesn't have the money for her to be, to invest. Okay? He doesn't like the, the fat face and the bad skin and she was getting fat and he was calling her a linebacker. I don't like you because you're too big. You're getting too big. Okay? They tear you down to make them look good. You up in the gym working your brains out because you don't like gyms. We know that. You're trying to eat healthy because this man has called you fat. Yeah, Martel is dipping and dabbing in some dark stuff. Be careful. And I'm telling Mel, if did, you know, if if you want to get that dark cloud, you're gonna have to be careful. And uh, when it comes down to this revenge P, you better get, you better do it. You better be careful because they got it and they plan on. Doing stuff that you would never believe that anybody can do. But God sent a ram in the bush by the name of Carson Blue to stop it. But baby, they were finna destroy you, ma'am.
and uh, like he said, he came in, yeah, Martel came in my comment saying you wasn't going to do nothing. You didn't have the proof. You got power. He, he, in his mind, you never going to do nothing. He still has your mind. You know, he thinks you will never get married again because guess what? You still, he still has that pull on you. Oh, yeah, that's how he thinks. That's a narcissist. You should know that. But this is how this joker thinks. And y'all, he's dangerous because he's desperate and he is seeking darkness to see how he can get his life back. And Ariane is just as dark as he is. She is an evil entity. She talked about uh, her, her sweet, you know, fragile heart. She was never sweet. She was never fragile. She's been devious since day one. Why do you keep putting yourself in other people's marriages? Why does Marcel's marriage um, concern you so much? Because you was a pass around. You was a hoe. And that's how they treat their hoes. You wasn't the kind of hoe that know how to shut up. Marcel was like, hell no. I, I talked to her, but Martel, hey, come here. Let me tell you something, Martel. Marcel had a plan for your ass from day one. Yeah, he used you. From day one, he knew this girl right here, she got a mouth. She gonna ruin them and we gonna be on top. And by the time Tisha finds out anything about what's going on, she gonna be so happy because Tisha won't fame too. We're gonna be that couple. And we're gonna take this show. Hmm. Interesting theory. Yeah. Look how it's turning out. Stay tuned for part two, baby. It gets deep.